Hello everyone, I'm Rubix and in this video I'll be teaching you how to install the simple voice chat mod which is a proximity voice chat mod for Minecraft Java edition. Also I'll be showing you how to make a server which supports this mod. By the way it's the same mod you might have seen YouTubers like Green, Impulse, Bdubs, Exuma using on Hermitcraft. This tutorial is only for the fabric mod loader and not for forts. So the mods are not intercompatible. It's super easy so let's get started. This video will be divided into three parts. The first part will be about installing simple voice mod on the Minecraft client. In the second part I will be showing you how to create a Minecraft server which supports this mod. In the third part I will be giving you a demo. The timestamps of these parts will be available in the description. Let's get started by going to the first link in the description below which will take you to Fabric MC's installer download page. Here you can download the jar file or the exe file. I'll be downloading the jar file. All the jar files we'll be downloading in this video are all completely safe. Now go to the second link in the description below which will take you to Fabric API's download page. Download Fabric API for the Minecraft version you plan to use from these ones. Now go to the third link in the description which will take you to simple voice chat mods download page. Download the file which begins with fabric and the correct one for your minecraft version. And do not download the ones which begin with forge. While you're waiting for the file to get downloaded why not subscribe to our channel it's really helpful. Then go to the 4th link in the description which will take you to Optifabrics website. Now download the one for your Minecraft version. This is completely optional but highly recommended as it improves your Minecraft performance. If you plan to use Optifabric you will have to download Optifine. So now go to the 5th link in the description which will take you to Optifine's website. Again download the one for your Minecraft version. Now that all the required files are downloaded, go to your downloads folder. Here are the 5 files. Start off by opening the file named fabric installer. Select the minecraft version you want from this drop down box. Now click install. Once it says installation is complete you can close it. Right click on the start button and select run. Now type percentage app data percentage in this box. Then press OK. Go to the dot minecraft folder. Now search for a folder named mods. If it's not there don't worry you can always create one. Now copy all the files except the fabric installer to the mods folder.
Now open your Minecraft launcher. Go to the installations tab. Here you should see a new installation created with the name Fabric Loader. Select it and click play. Once Minecraft launches, you should be able to join any multiplayer server which supports this mod and use proximity chat on it. Create an empty folder to begin with. Copy the file named Fabric Installer to the new folder. Open the copied file which is in the new folder. Go to the Server tab. Select the Minecraft version you want to use. Then click Install. Now click on Download Server Jar. Then click on Generate and Done. Now open the file named start.bat. Close it once it says press any key to continue. Then right click the start.bat file and select edit. Now remove everything in here and paste the exact code which is in the description below. Then save it. Now open the eula.txt file. Next replace eula equals false with true. Then save it. Now open the mods folder and copy the files named fabric api and voice chat to here. By the way, these are the files we downloaded in the beginning. If you are going to be using Crack Minecraft, you will have to disable online mode. You can do that by opening the server.properties file using notepad. Then replace online mode equals true with false. Next, save it. Now make sure to port forward both the ports 25565 for the Minecraft server and 24454 for the voice chat. That is only if you want to play with your friends over the internet. You won't have to do it if you want them to connect through LAN. Also I will leave a link to a tutorial in the description below which goes through all the details and the process of port forwarding. Finally, it's time to start your Minecraft server. Do it by opening the start.bat file. It may take some time because of it being started for the first time and it will also depend on your computer speed. Once it says done exactly like this, you are ready to go and play on it with the proximity chat. But before we play on the server, I want to show you how to change some settings which changes how the mod behaves. First, go to your server folder then go to config voice chat finally open voice chat server.properties file with notepad here you can change a bunch of settings which changes how the mod behaves i will leave a link to the mod documentation page in the description which explains what every setting located here does You can join the server by either typing your computer's local IP address or by typing localhost like this. Once you join the server, you should be able to press V to open the GUI of voice chat. Here you can go to settings and change the voice activation type. You can also change the microphone and the speakers you want to use with the voice chat. 
you can press M to mute your mic and N to mute your speakers. One last thing you can press escape, go to options, controls and scroll all the way down. Here you can change all the key binds you want to use with the voice chat. Hey Bison Ninja, how are you? Hey, I'm great. And how's the voice mod working? It's so cool, I'm amazed, I can hear you in Minecraft. Oh, that's awesome. Now let's uh, show you guys the stereo effect. Baizo, can you stand to my right and say something? Hello, I'm standing to your right. Okay, cool. And now to my left. Hello, I'm standing to your left. Perfect. Okay, uh, now can you stand over there? And now let me go a bit far away. Now the voice should be faint. I barely hear you now. Let me come back. Now is my voice loud again? Yes, I can hear you now. Perfect. Okay, that's going to be it for the demo. Thank you Bison Ninja for joining me. Also check out his YouTube channel, link is in the description below. And now Baizo, do you want to say anything to the audience? Yeah, subscribe to the Big Stars. Subscribe to his channel too. And I didn't force him to say that. Uh, thanks for coming Baizo. See you next time. Check out these awesome videos on your screen. Click on the left to watch a tutorial about Among Us proximity chat or click on the right to watch a video that YouTube recommends. Also make sure you subscribe if you want to be notified when I upload my next video.